Right, I forgot to tell you guys the best thing about this tractor. It only costs a couple of grand to fill it up with diesel. Chain Harrows are back on and I'm back out with the John Deere 5300. I've got these two grass fields down here that I want to get harrowed. It'll be a nice little job for the 53 and she's on the perfect size for the job as well. It is in there somewhere. Here we go. Radio. <laughs> Will, you broke this, mate. I know you think it was me, but. Well, hang on a minute. We've got a light. <laughs> oh, it's so awkward. I think I can hear something. Hang on. Hey. It's working. <laughs> I just can't press any of the buttons. Yeah, we'll have a, uh, a look later. Get that sorted. Just had another lorry turn up for some wheat. I think Ray is on the job.
Got the hump, then perhaps lift it up a bit because it might drag on the back end of it. It's just because it's that hump. That hump. Whoa, whoa! Got me, Garrett. It was. It was. Just have a look. Okay. Well, it's out. It's out, yeah. No damage. No damage. Looks smart on that tractor, right, isn't it? It does, yeah. Yeah. Spray it blue. Spray it blue? Amazon Blue. Amazon Blue. <laughs> <laughs> they don't, but they should do. <laughs> well, I think that's the workshop. We can get your rollers in, Ray. Your foot rollers have been stripped down. Yeah, the other rollers are not in there. That's right, I don't have to take them out, but the other one's in there, do you? Uh, that'd be a bit easier, wouldn't it? But yeah. Do you want to try and unfold it first, or...? No. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get Dad to unfold it. <laughs> this is his machine. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we'll get Dad out here. So the idea is to use this pneumatic spreader to get the next dose of fertiliser on as it's going to be a bit more accurate than our Amazon disc spinner. And uh, yeah, didn't think it was going to go through the door. It's never been on this tractor before, so that's good. Right, we're we'll getting these fertilizer rollers in then this lever here that locks it in I think Ray I don't know if I'll put my hand through here you'd lift it up I think what can help out perhaps that ends by doing that How's that? Yep, and then I think we use that lever to lock it in, don't we? How's that look? Like that, that's it. Yeah, 17, Ray, I reckon. I'm probably going to be wrong, though. I'll well, bring a 19 just as well. Yeah, I would bring a 19 just in case. 17? Yeah. It is. Look at that. Good. 19 mil this side. Nice. <laughs> 17. <laughs> Are you the operator then, Dad? I think I'm the only operator, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> You're going to go in, aren't you? I probably will. It's yeah. just you've, you've always uh, loved this machine, haven't you? This, I, I, I do love it, actually. This spreader. like a transformer. It was going a bit quick, so I'll turn the uh, flow of oil down. Try on the rotors. Can you try the wall or? Oh no, try this side. Yeah. Yeah. Second. Yeah. 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 Righto. 
Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it's all three. Yeah. 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 Well, it works, right? It works. Even that one, which was going to be, uh, could have been suspect. Yeah. That's good. That's not wrong. <laughs> the clutches work all right then, right? Don't they? Yeah. No, no issues there at all. It all, all works. Yeah, and it will start when you switch in. Yeah. Come on. You always want a camera here, Nick. See if they are rolling. Yeah. Especially with the Avidex, when you can't see yeah, it coming out. Yeah. I think this urea, we might be able to see it. I'm hoping you'll see it, Nick. Hope yeah. so. With the, with the rate we're doing, hopefully we will. You didn't want a sticky uh, solenoid, but they're in fairly good order of solenoids, I think. But obviously, they're working. You just don't feel comfortable unless you know they are working. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah. Yeah. 